Welcome back once again to howtocookgreatfood.com. On the main today, very simple, we're just gonna poach some salmon. I've had a lot of messages about this. It's very, very easy, it's beautiful. It's a great way of cooking salmon, actually. Let's go and do it. Okay, so look, here's our salmon steaks. One, two, three, four, five different sizes. What we're gonna do is we're gonna get this into some water salt and lemon we're going to cook it in there then we can peel it off and flake it about use it for you know different things actually let's go over to the cooker now and do that okay so i've got this frying pan or skillet you can use anything else i'm using this so you guys can see it clearly a couple of centimeters of cold water we're going to drop our fish into that i like to add few bay leaves in there, optional, salt, and then some lemon or lime which we can just squeeze a little bit of it as we're putting it in. The heat's going to go on, we're not going to put this on a high heat, you don't want to be boiling the life out of it, you want to kind of just kind of poach it a little bit so a nice kind of medium heat for about six or seven minutes. Okay, so we're done. Now I've just used bay leaf, lemon and salt, but you could make a court bouillon, which is celery, fennel, peppercorns, onions, as well as bay leaf and the lemon. I'm just going really simply, just, just with the, the, those ingredients, but yeah, you could make the court bouillon if you wanted. Okay, let's get them out. Okay, and there you go, very, very simple and beautiful. You can eat it just like that, obviously. And if you want, you can, like I say, you can Take it, once it cools down, break it, flake it, make a, a pate from it, or you could make a salad from it, an omelette, so many different things. Now I've used salmon steaks, it will also work with a, a filet as well. If you're gonna do it with a filet, make sure that you put the skin side down into the water. Very simple. Okay, just a couple of bonus little bits I'm gonna do now, so you've seen how to poach it. What I'm gonna do now is I'm gonna break it up, get the skin off, try and get any pin bones out of it. I'm gonna make a salad and we're going to make a pate. Okay then, so look, there's a little bits of bone on that. There's quite a few pin bones in this and the skin. Got that off. Try and do it as well as you can. And we've got two lots here. One I'm going to use for a salad, one we're going to use for a pate. Very easy. Okay, so we're going to start off by doing a little salmon salad. Nothing to it really. I've got some mixed leaves there. There's our salmon flaked. Now what I'm putting in this one is some bell peppers tomatoes, cucumber, and I've got some fresh basil there and some olives. Also got a little bit of mayonnaise and some lemon juice. We're gonna pop that in, make a kind of little quick lemon mayonnaise. Very simple. Okay, so the mayonnaise is there. Just a little bit of lemon or lime juice. Just mix that in. This gives it a nice kind of lemony flavor. If you wanted, you could season it, but we're gonna season the salad anyway. Beautiful, let's move on. So the serving plate, I've put my green leaves on. Like I say, I'm using this mix lot. You can use whatever you want. What we're gonna do is we're gonna pop some tomatoes around there. Same with the cucumber. I mean, there's lots of other things you could be adding to this, isn't there? You could add some beans to this, celery, some raw mushrooms, some roasted vegetables if you fancied. I'm just gonna do a quick, simple little salad for us today. What I'm gonna do is I'm gonna pop out Salmon just in the centre and just open it out just a little bit. I love that fresh basil. I pretty much love fresh basil of everything actually. Just a wonderful, wonderful herb. Just gonna get a few olives around. I'm now going to pour this lemon mayonnaise around the edge like that. A little bit of salt. Black pepper. 
I actually like plenty of black pepper on this one. And there you go, that's done. So beautiful like that. I mean, serve it like that. Once it's on the table, you can give it a mix. Very, very easy. Let's move on. Okay, so we've poached, we've salad. Now we're gonna do this pate, really, really simple. This is great on some toast or something like that. We've got our salmon ready, cream cheese. I'm gonna use some fresh mint. You could be using some dill or a different herb if you want. A tiny amount of lemon juice, salt and pepper, that's it. Now, we're gonna get that in a bowl and mix it by hand. Or like I'm gonna do, I'm just gonna pop it in my food processor. Zzz, it's done. So in goes the salmon. I've got as many of the pin bones out as I can. I think I've got them all out. The cream cheese. Now, that's up to you how much you want to put in. You can really play around with this, you know. I'm going to go for mint. Like I say, you could maybe go with dill or parsley. Tiny amount of lemon juice. Some salt and pepper. I'm going to get the lid on that back in a moment. Just going to just whiz it around for like 30 seconds, 40 seconds. Okay, and there you go. So that's a lovely consistency. So, so easy and really, really delicious. Just serve that with some bread. I've got some sourdough bread here that I'm using. So that's it. So we've done the poaching of the salmon. We've done the salmon salad and now we've done the pate or the mousse. Hope you enjoyed that. Don't forget to subscribe to our channel. We will see you soon. Lots of love. Thank you very much for taking time to watch our cooking videos. Hope you enjoyed them. Lots going on. We've got a, a new vegan channel, which we're trying to promote at the moment. Just 100% vegan, so please check that out. Chef June has started his own Filipino cooking channel. He's still going to be appearing here with me on How to Cook Great, but he started his own one. And we've got Rahel, who's doing great stuff on her Amaric or Ethiopian cooking channel. So if you're into either of those things or those three things, please check them out. The links might pop up here or they'll be down below. If you'd like to support the channel, which I really do hope you do, you can by buying us a cup of coffee. It's going to cost you a couple of dollars. Just follow the link, PayPal or whatever it is. Um, really, really would help us if you do that. I think that's about it. We're doing fine. We hope you're well. Subscribe to us. That helps us out a lot. Give us a thumbs up. We do like that. And more importantly, please do leave us a comment. We do like to hear from you and see what you're up to. That's it. Be safe. Be well. We'll see you soon. Lots of love.